Hello, hello, this is Pixelated Twix and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. This is a new game we're going to check out, you guys. I just want to get right to it. It's called Arietta of Spirits. It is in demo version currently. Um, it's, there's not a full version available, but it will be available sometime this year. I don't have the specifics, but I can definitely get that for you and make sure that's linked in the description box below. Uh, this is by an indie... Um, an indie prod or it's an indie prod or indie productions uh, I don't know a whole lot about this game because I didn't want to do too much research because I wanted to go on this quite blind um, I did start watching one video like one minute into it and I decided to stop it there so this is going to be a blind playthrough of the demo I'm not sure how far we can get but frankly, this is uh, a pixelated game. You can see that by the art, and we do love a good pixelated game here. They're very near and dear to my heart. I do like all kinds, all types of video games, but there's just a special place, special place for pixelated uh, games like Stardew Valley, like Ken Seed, and we'll see what this one's about. All right, let's hop in the game. Um, I did check the settings. I think the music is perfect. Ambiance is good. So let's get in. I'm not really sure about the controls. There's, I can't use a mouse, so we may have a hiccup or two, but who knows? All right, so let's grab an empty spot. Of course, our progress is being saved, and that's our little icon to let, it, let us know that it's saving. All right. Uh, oh, cutscene. I love the graphics. Arietta. How long still? Uh, so how do I get to the next screen? Enter? No? Um, let's see. I don't know. Can't can do any controls. Hmm. Okay. Return to the game. I don't know, guys. Oh. Almost there. X. Guys, it's X. Half an hour or so. We can drive straight to the shore and take the boat from there. It's not like this is your first time here. Right. I can't believe it's been a year already. Yeah. Feels weird for me too. It's going to be the first time there without her. I'm sure the cabin needs a big fixing up. Wouldn't want Grandma's place to deteriorate. I guess so. Cheer up, Mom. Now look who's talking. Weren't you just moping around a minute ago? Who remembers that? Hey, do you think the water's cold? I think it should be fine. You know what? I'm sure everything will be just like before. The feels already. I don't know why. Another cutscene. Look at Arietta. Ari, can we call her that? All right, she's just sitting by herself at the shore. Oh, this there's Dad. Long trip, huh? 
Yeah. I'm beat. We've got some work ahead of us. Too bad it's my summer vacation, so I better just take it easy, right? Very funny. Your mother was looking for you. Says she needed help with something? She should be in the cabin. Oh, I better go and ask what's up. I think I'm going to start with some yard work. The garden looks like a jungle. I mean, it doesn't look terrible. Grandma would hate seeing it like this. And it seems like there's no going to the forest side spring at the moment. <laughs> a tree has fallen on the pathway. I think I'm going to start by clearing it out. Gee whiz. It'll probably take me all day. Hang on there, Dad. It's a lot bouncier than Stardew Valley. Um, but it looks like it's starting off in the, our typical pixelated fashion with these kind of um, games where, of course, the, there's a path that's blocked. It's got to be cleared. And we, we've got a cabin that was once owned by Grandma. And it's kind of, it needs a, to be fixed up. And then we've got a sort of overgrown garden. It doesn't look, really look overgrown to me, but we'll go with it. Nothing like... Uh, Sturdy Vale, of course, but I just want to see where we're going. Oh, maybe I shouldn't wander too far off from the cabin. Okay, yeah. I, I was just checking things out. All right. Um, what's over here? Okay, so we've got like a shed and such. So let's go ahead to the house. Mom is expecting us. Uh, X, okay. X is our main key here. Just want to take a good look around. So this must be Ari's uh, bedroom. What's here? Can we go here? Okay, this is her parents' room. Or grandma's probably, grandma's room maybe. Can we pick anything up? Can we sit on anything? I'm just curious as how the um, things move around. Okay, so everything's pretty stagnant. Let's talk to mom. Hi, Mom. Oh, hi, honey. You need my help with something? Yeah, I do. I just started cooking a dinner, and I was thinking I'd make us some apple crumble as a dessert. That sounds good. But we didn't bring any apples with us. Could you be a sweetie and go pick up some? The trees are quite far, but if you follow the trail through... Uh, through west of the cab. I know, I know. I love the sour apples from the big tree. I like sour apples too. Yeah, your grandma liked those too. Oh, hey, I'll go and get them right away. So, um, of course, we can presume that grandma has passed. And I guess this is now their vacation home. Now, she said something about taking the path. Looks like Dad's doing some whittling. Um, is this the way we can need to go? Arietta, wait up. Okay, whoops. Where are you heading? I can read. Mom asked me to get some apples for us. She's gonna make apple crumble. Nice. I love that stuff. Oh, oh, <laughs> if you're heading there, you might want to keep your eye out for wasps. Oh, okay. They are especially nasty this time of year, and the island is full of them. You should take this with you. Take this. It's dangerous. You have received a wooden sword plus C to perform an attack move. All right. Okay, so we've got some Zelda action going on. Dad, I'll be 13 soon. Don't you think I'm a little too old to play around with this? 
Maybe, but I don't want you to get stung. I mean, how many of us are actually taking a wooden sword out in the woods with us to kill wasps? So if these pesky buzzards come after you, just give them a smack with it. That'll work. It may not be sharp, but it's solid wood, so it should pack a punch. That's true. Right. She looks disappointed. Thanks, Dad. Or she's unsure. Uh, remember when you used to run around as a kid, always swinging that sword around? It drove your mother crazy. Good times, yeah? Yeah, yeah. I'll be right back with the apples. All right, so we've got, we've got, oh, okay. Let me turn some settings down. Cause it sounds like to me, the sound effects might be a little on the loud side. Um, ambiance will turn down to just a tad and okay. So we're good. Let's go, Ari. Oh, oh, the squirrel. See, all right, nice. I'm gonna have to get used to the controls. I'm not used to just strictly keyboard. I think I played a game like this, Moonlighter, that was like the, exactly strictly keyboard. And it uh, took me a minute to adjust. Oh, those are huge wasps. Oh, oh, oh. Look at this, this is not easy. Okay. I see what we're doing here. I see now. Okay. We're gonna have to two hand this. Now, oh, okay, wait, let's go back. Let's check these bushes. Oh, they respawned. Jeez. All right. Okay, I kind of like that combat. It's gonna take some getting used to, but um, let's see here we go. Can now, can we? Okay, we can smack the trees. Okay. Of course, we've got to check everything now. I wonder if, uh, oop, it's a fiery wasp? Excuse me. Nice. Okay. Uh, we were supposed to go this way, right? <laughs> Ooh, okay. Surprise me. I see how. Oh, there's apples. Look at that. Nice. How do we? How do we get this stuff? Oh. Pacha. All right, now how do we get apples? Do we just press X maybe? No? How do we get apples? Uh, maybe that's, you know what? That's, that doesn't look like an apple tree, does it? I don't know what that is. Um, okay, we're exposed, girl, we're exposed. Let's head this way. I don't think we're supposed to be this far away from home, but, um, oh well. <laughs> Can't go that way. Another bee coming. Or wasp. Oh! Kiting. Oh! Those things hurt. Um, oh! Let's be a little careful. We don't want to die out here. Um, I don't know what the death pe the death penalty. I don't know what the penalty is for dying in this game. Um, if it's anything like Moonlighter, we're going to be kicked right back to the beginning of this this area. Um, okay. Right now the combat's pretty basic, but 
probably going to see some upgrades as we continue on. That's what I'm assuming. Uh, but I have yet to find one apple, y'all. Um, <laughs> not an apple in sight. I highly doubt we were supposed to go this far. You know what it is? Ari didn't want to do any work. That's what it was. Oh, AOE attack for the win. Yes. Uh, ooh. Okay, let's see. Where are we going next? Up here? Whoa, we are so far from home now. I wonder if there's a day-night cycle. Okay, that looks like a birdhouse. I think that's what that other thing was. A little birdhouse. Ooh, okay. Apple trees. Awesome. We made it. Okay. The big tree in the middle has always given the best apples. But how am I going to reach them when they're so high up? Uh, dilemma. Okay, she's thinking things through. Maybe with enough force, I can make some of them fall. Maybe. Are we gonna high yacht down? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. That did it. <laughs> Get those apples, girl. Can we do it again? Nope. How about this? Nope. So it's just a one tree. Can't get any more. Okay, we're being greedy now. Gotcha. Oh! Oh, no. It's a boss fight. Oh, crap. It's cra oh, crap is right. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Uh, sorry. I didn't know you guys had a hive in there. Oh, no. Press space to perform a roll. Rolling is useful when trying to dodge. And okay. So, rolling. Oh, oh, oh. No chill, no chill. No chill. Oh, no. Oh, no. Ads. Kite. Kite. Okay, so jeez. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. That's fun. Phew! Yeah, that was close. That was so close. I'm almost died. I better get back to the cabin. You better, girl. Let's head back. Let's get those apples. Those apples better have been worth it. I mean, we've got a story to tell later, though. We really do. All right. She's all pumped now. She is hyped. She's like, I killed a giant wasp. Babbled it out. Check these out. All right. Yes. Clear this up. Sweet. Clear this garden up. We made short work of this garden. Look at that. Okay, let's give mom her apples. Did yard work too. Ooh, one more bush. Yep. All right, let's head in. Mom, you wouldn't believe. You wouldn't believe. Got the apples. Is that all you're going to tell her? Thanks, hon. Oh, you've got plenty. This will only take a minute. Really? Go and tell your dad dinner's ready. Yes, ma'am. 
<laughs> she didn't even say anything. Ari, you sly dog. Of course she wouldn't tell her parents that there's giant wasps out in the woods. Um, where's her dad? He's over here. He's clearing stuff up. Okay, hey dad, what's up? Give me just a second. All right, well. Oh, er, her? <laughs> her. <laughs> Whoa, dad. Key man. Phew. Dang, that took a long time. Dad, we just seen you like chop up that tree in like two seconds. Hey, you're back. Those wasps give you a hard time? Uh, nothing I couldn't handle. Ari. Honey, we almost died out there. I don't know. Dinner is almost done. Yeah? Let's go and set the table. <laughs> I don't know why I said that. I don't know why. I I don't know why. Sorry. Oh, cutscene. Oh, look at this. That looks so cozy. Hey, Kool-Aid. <laughs> oh, <clears throat> excuse me. <sighs> Sigh. Everything okay, dear? Is he washing dishes? Look at that. Yes, it's... It's just, I know, Grandma, isn't it? Is Grandma your mom? I've been to this island every summer of my life. Oh, yet this is the first time here without her. Oh. That empty chair is almost more than I can bear. This all just brings back so many memories. Mm. I swear I can still feel her here. Yet when I turn around to see, she's she's not there. Oh, it's touching. I don't know why. Not anymore. Mom. I miss her so much. We all miss her. I expected that this visit... It, it's expected that this visit brings up some emotions. But I'm sure your mother is smiling down on us and is really glad that we've kept on this tradition. Oh, it is her mother. I guess so. Thank you. It'll get better. Oh, gosh. Look at how they capture the, the emotion. Just, it's been a long day with the traveling and all. Maybe we should get some sleep. Everything will look different tomorrow. Oh, my gosh. Wow, guys. Mm, that that was kind of emotional. Um, I I would think that anybody who lost a parent or just thinking about losing one, oh man, Oof, that's that's hard. That's hard to even imagine. Arietta, huh? Arietta. Uh, please tell me Grandma has not come back. Oh. Oh my gosh, Arietta. Arietta. Girl, those ghosts. Girl, there's ghosts. Arietta. Arietta. Oh, Arietta. Look. I don't do well with ghosts. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Are we gonna have to kill ghosts, please? Oh my gosh. Okay, okay. What is going on here? Oh, this can't be good. Are we supposed to kill these guys? <gasps> oh 
Oh. Okay. Please. What's that about? Wow. Wake up. Finally. Who's talking? Here. Um, here where? Huh? Oh, jeez. Girl, it scared me too. Ack! A ghost. Shh, not so loud. We don't want to wake your parents. I can assure you, I'm not a ghost. Although, I understand my looks may hint otherwise. I must be dreaming still. I'm afraid you're wide awake. Unfortunately, the situation has dictated that I reveal myself ahead of time. Huh? Wh what do you mean? Arietta, I have known you for a long time. Although you haven't seen me before, I have been hiding in the shadows through most of your life. Okay, that's creepy. I have waited many years for this moment. You're a mystical stalker? Listen carefully. I have something important to tell you. My name is Arco. I come from a realm that exists in parallel to the world that you know. It is called the spirit realm. Up until now, it has been completely invisible to you, as it is to any other. For eons, my, have, my kind have served the humans as guides, working together, helping those who have perished and gotten lost, becoming spirits, trapped echoes of existence, unable to find their way forward. This is nothing like Stardew Valley. <laughs> I have given you the ability to perceive the spirit realm around you by binding my energy with yours. You are now what my kind calls a bound, a human that is bound to their spirit guide, which I am to you. This is crazy. Realms and spirits? So do you mean like ghosts? If you want to put it that way. The spirit realm is like a veil resting on top of the human world. When a human dies but cannot move on to the afterlife, they get caught in that veil. Their energy gets trapped and thus becomes a spirit. There is always a reason to why one ends up this way. An unresolved matter from when they were alive or the inability to realize one's fortunate fate, unfortunate fate. Our job is to help these spirits to move on. Oh. She doesn't understand, or she's trying to. Okay. Let's say I believe you. But why do you need me? Why not just help these spirits or whatever by yourself? My kind only ever exists as ethereal beings formed out of pure energy. We do not possess a physical body, not even in the spirit realm. Therefore, it's impossible for us to make any true difference to the surrounding world. You, however, as a bound, now have the means to interact between both realms, the human world and the spirit realm. Our job is to seek out and guide people like you who we deem fit for the task. 
and you have displayed a great deal of courage and righteousness, traits that we value throughout your life. Especially so for someone as young as yourself. Hmm. Yet, it is very uncommon that we grant this ability to anyone until they've come out of age. But something has come up. Arietta, there is someone who's in, a, in dire need of your help. I wonder if it's her grandma. Okay. She's waiting for you on the pier. All right. With that, you guys, we're going to go ahead and leave it there. I know. Uh huh. On the precipice. Who could be waiting for us at the pier? I don't know, but we'll find out in our next episode. I hope you guys are really enjoying this. I'm going to see also if I need to adjust the sound because it did seem kind of loud in my ear and I felt like I was yelling over the, the music and the ambiance. So we may need to, to adjust that later. All right, guys. Uh, I do hope that you're enjoying this so far. Let me know what you think about Arietta uh, Realm of Spirits um, in the comments below. We'll definitely uh, take a look at this again. Um, and uh, hopefully we'll get to find out next time. Well, we will definitely get to find out next time who's at the pier. All right, guys. I will talk to you later. Ciao.